All right, so we're going to go from car seats to laptops to phones and even e-bikes. Reports of batteries catching fire have become almost commonplace. Yeah, and among those reports are injuries, even deaths we're talking about. Heat is the primary contributing factor, and of course, we have plenty of that around right now. So new this morning, John Shumway is here with some words of caution, and this always makes me concerned every time we report one of these fires. Yeah, you know, the fire prevention people will say we really need to pay attention to this because we love our electronic gizmos. They're not going anywhere, but the hazard experts say they need to be treated as the threat that they are. The images of a North Carolina toddler's burned up car seat from a lithium button battery in a book is a wake up call. And until it, it touches you or someone you know, um, you, you don't really think about it. Allegheny County Emergency Services Assistant Chief Steve Imbarlina says we need to respect the batteries because we certainly can't avoid them. They're in our cell phones, they're in our laptops, they are in uh, children's toys, they are in cordless power tools. And our e-bikes and scooters and electric cars. So, rule number one. Uh, make sure that you are using the correct battery for the correct device. And the correct charger. And resist the urge of buying that aftermarket cord, that aftermarket charger. Chief Imbarlina says treat them with care. The biggest things that make lithium ion batteries fail is, is heat and physical damage. The book in the car seat case was left in a hot car. The chief says heat a battery and it expands and things inside that shouldn't mix do and they go up quickly. They produce a lot of visible fire, a lot of heat, but more importantly and along with it, they produce a lot of smoke. So keep these things in mind. Avoid you know, charging overnight when it's not being monitored. Never have a plugged in charging device in bed and once they're charged, take them off the charger. Don't leave them perpetually on the charger until the next time you use the device. Because if they're left on the charger, they can overheat and catch fire. Again, a battery doesn't have to be on charge to overheat. It can happen in a hot car or near any kind of a heat source. And primarily we're talking about lithium ion batteries, but not entirely, right? Yeah, actually uh, lithium ion get all of the publicity, but the fact is even an alkaline battery in the right circumstances, the right amount of heat or even damage can short circuit and catch fire. It just makes me think about all the things I have plugged in for long periods of time that perhaps right. I shouldn't do. Yeah, that, that are charging right yes, now. I can yeah. think of something in the garage Easily. right now. Yeah, exactly. easy. All right, all right. good stuff it. to think about it.